everyone, welcome to our second episode of Burn Brains. Today we are going to do a little arts and crafts. We are going to learn how to draw a little bunny and a little baby chick just in time for Easter this Sunday. So what you're gonna need is a piece of paper and a pencil, maybe some crayons, colored pencils, whatever you wanna use to color, okay? We're gonna get started. You can pause the video if you need to to go get the materials you need, but I'm gonna go ahead and get started. So first we're gonna draw the bunny and I'm gonna show you step-by-step step what to do. So our first step is we're gonna draw anywhere on your paper that you want a smaller circle for the bunny's head, just like this. Smaller circle, just for the bunny's head. Then we're gonna draw a little bit of a bigger circle kind of on the back end to make the bunny's body. There you go. Just like that. We're gonna make the little bunny's body. Now we're gonna draw an even smaller circle on the back side of that circle to make the little bunny tail. There you go, little bunny tail right there. Next, we're gonna make kind of like a, a half oval for its leg. So here's the first one, just like that. Then you're gonna draw one again right next to it so that you have its two front feet. There we go. Next, you're gonna draw just one just like that other oval, a half oval on the back side so you can see its back leg. Just like that. Next, we're gonna draw his ears. So you're gonna draw one tall oval. Right on the top, just like that. And then you're gonna do another one right next to it. So now you have two bunny ears. And right inside of that, you're gonna draw a little bit smaller oval. Just like that, so you can see the inside of his ears. Now we're gonna draw his nose. So you're gonna draw an upside down triangle. Upside down triangle, right in the middle of the bunny's face. Then you're gonna draw two lines coming out of the triangle to make our bunny's mouth. Just like that, one line to each side. And now you can draw two dots right above all of that for the bunny's eyes. There's the bunny's eyes. And you guys have just completed your bunny. Look at that. And you can even give your little bunny paws if you want, draw some lines on his feet. Okay, you can draw some little lines on his feet to make it look like your bunny has toes or you can draw a little puffiness, a little puff pad on the back of his tail. So he looks like he's got a little fluffy tail. All right, so now your bunny is complete. Now we're gonna draw our little baby chick. So on the other side of our paper, we have our bunny here. Now on the other side of our paper, on the bottom, we're gonna draw another small circle for our baby chick's head. There we go, there's our small circle for our baby chick's head. Now, we're gonna draw a bigger circle for his body. Right underneath the head, you're gonna draw a big circle. So now we have the baby chick's body. Next, we're gonna draw kind of like a triangle, but we're gonna have some waves on the bottom. Let me show you. You're gonna come down, and a little, three little waves. So you come down and do one, two, three. And that's our baby chick's first wing, their first little wing. Now you're gonna do it again on the other side for the baby chick's second wing. So now our baby chick has two wings. Next, we're gonna draw our baby chick's feet. So to start, you're gonna draw two rectangles at the bottom of his body, just like that. One on each side for the baby chick's legs. 
Next, we're gonna add some toes, some little toes. Add three little toes to the bottom of their feet. There we go. Add your three little toes to the bottom of your baby chick's legs. And now you have baby chick feet. Next, we're gonna draw the baby chick's nose. So again, we're gonna draw an upside down triangle for their beak, because the baby chick has a beak. There we go, upside down triangle right in the middle. Next, you can draw your eyes for your baby chick right above the, the beak. You can add a little bit of fluff on the top of their little fuzzy head. So they have a little bit of fuzz. And then if you want, you don't have to, you can draw a little belly inside of the baby chick. So you can see their little belly. Now your baby chick is all drawn. So you should have a baby bunny and a baby chick. Now it's your turn to get creative. You can draw whatever you want on your paper. You can write Happy Easter. You can write, I did grass. I did some flowers. I colored my bunny. My bunny's brown and has a pink little nose and some blue eyes and some pink ears. My baby chick is all yellow with an orange beak and they have some blue eyes and some little brown feet and I colored their little fuzz on the top of their head yellow. I made an Easter basket with some eggs. I made a pretty blue sky with a nice big sun. So now it's your turn to be very creative. I wanna see what you can do. Take this plain, boring little bunny and chick and turn it into a beautiful masterpiece. When you're all done with your beautiful masterpiece, take a picture and post it in the comments below. I can't wait to see what your baby chicken bunny look like. See you guys next week for Burn Brains.